Good morning, good morning, good morning, everybody. Mr. Jimmy coming to you one more time this morning on uh on a Thursday morning. On a throwback Thursday morning. Throwback. Got to come up with some some throwback, some uh back in the past uh, pictures or something. Uh, <laughs> throwback Thursday. It is April 13th, 2023. On a Thursday morning early in the morning heading out on our destination to work we are traveling down Enoch Road early this morning headed to, t headed to work to get it done folks I had a pretty good night's rest I slept good I feel like I could have slept another 40 hours <laughs> but I'd have been feeling rough body will start aching if you sleep too much if you lay in the bed too much your body will start aching unless you're sleeping I guess if you're unconscious your body's doing its thing but anyway folks it's early this morning on our way to work and once again here I am making a video and for any of y'all that have never seen my videos never never watched any of them don't even know what this is about a lot of times I like to call them my talk therapy video because I get out here on my way to work in the morning start fresh to get everything off the top of my head so when I get to work so when I get to work I am focused I am focused on my job that's what it's all about my friends when I, when I roll it strong in the morning time like this right here I'm just I'm just shaking loose all the memories or all the thoughts that's been running through my head for the last uh, 24 hours since my last video. How about that? But if you want a little bit more in depth about me, there's plenty of videos in the on my uh, on my YouTube channel. And uh, by all means, also if this is the first time you've stumbled across my videos and you're finding my little bit of interest in what I have to say or or anything just right down there on the bottom right hand corner click that subscribe button jump aboard my train i would greatly appreciate y'all ride along with me listen to me run my mouth about just everyday stuff uh morning time like this is about the only time i really do my morning time talk it's a talk video if you're here to see some exciting uh visual and I don't really see a whole lot but the dark sky and the dark road traveling down the highways and byways. That's about all it's going to be video. Because this is about my talking, about my talk video, about my talk therapy. I call it a talk therapy because it actually helps me, you know. Helps me to get all the stuff out. Sometimes if you ain't got nobody to talk to, it does good to talk to a camera. Because I don't really talk to nobody. I kind of keep to myself. So anyway, folks, we rolling strong. We're getting out on the big road now. The big four-lane highway 501. If you wonder where I'm at, I'm over in the Old Reed community. Right smack dab in the middle of Old Reed County. Located in the upper right-hand corner of the state of South Carolina. Right along the east coast of the United States of America. On this big beautiful planet we call earth my friends the folks let me tell you right now i am not a great speaker i am not a good speaker i stumble on what i talk about so just try to bear with me i might confuse you from time to time i may even jump from topic to topic i'll try my best to just flow with the information or thoughts that are running through my head it can be like a roller coaster you know what i'm saying friends it can be like a roller coaster so let's get into this right here oh wow what's been on my mind what's been running through my head okay i guess the biggest thing in my head this morning uh because the last several videos i've been talking about your know, relationships and social media and uh private messaging and I guess everything to do with the internet. So it seems fair I might as well continue to talk about the internet. <laughs> it seems to be the, the 
the main thing that goes on these days is the internet. Internet, internet, internet. I don't think we can live without the internet now. We've all got accustomed to having the internet at the tip of our finger. Or is it at the reach of our finger, the reach of our hand? I don't know how it goes. But I think the, the internet has spoiled all of us. You know, if I got a question, I Google it. If I need to know how to fix something other, I Google it. If I need to find a location, I Google it. If I need a part for my vehicle, I Google it. You know what I'm saying, folks? We are addicted to the internet. We can't do nothing without the internet. If we want to, if we want to listen to a song, we Google it. <laughs> Even if it's on YouTube or, or anything, you know, it's pretty much the same thing. I think Google pretty much runs everything just about. Um, but anyways, it's just life. It's the way is uh, the way we uh, live our life now is around the internet. You know, and it's sad sometimes, but then again, you know, it's, it's helped people to learn how to do stuff on their own, their own and figure things out or get information on how to do things and stuff like that. So it's all good. The internet is good. It's all good, but, you know, but it's like, uh, it's like, uh, what is it? I heard a fella say it one time. Or a, or a woman, I don't know who it was. I remember hearing some, somebody saying that nothing is all good. I heard somebody say, where did I hear that at? Nothing is all good. No one is all good. I heard that somewhere. Nobody is all good. Where did I hear that from? Anyways, I'll figure it out. Hey, I'll Google it. <laughs> But anyway, folks, are we rolling strong this morning? I'm only not uh, uh, El Bethel, El Bethel Road, and uh, rolling by the Walmart over there to the to the left, the Chaos Company. Um, but we rolling strong this morning. Like I said, I slept good. I I, uh, I slept like a baby. Uh, Meaning that I, I woke up every three hours, won't want, want, want to be cuddled. I'm no, just kidding. Um, it's just another day. So the thoughts in my head about the internet, it's just not really much to talk about. It is what it is. Everybody knows about, everybody knows about the internet and everything about it. So there's nothing I can say about the internet and nobody don't already know about it. Um, so we try to work around the internet. We try to, you know, and people use the internet for business purposes. You know, they have their company on online, online company, online business. They make money online, just like people that do YouTube. You know, you got people that are famous on YouTube. You got somebody that, you know, they could be a, a, a good looking person, especially if it's a female. And of course, all females are like, you know, if it's a male guy or whatever, uh, anyway. Uh, you know, people people get on YouTube and they make money. There's some people that make a living on YouTube. They make better living on YouTube just making videos or making less videos than I make. Uh, it's all to do with uh, how interesting and your video is, or whether or not you know it gets views or advertisements on it, all that kind of stuff. So, you know, I dibble dabble and, and, and I'm on YouTube, but I don't make no money because I'm not monetized or any of that stuff. I'm far from even being monetized. I got 400 subscribers, I think, hopefully. Um, I think you got to have over a thousand, over a thousand subscribers in order to be monetized. So, I'm a long way from that. Long way from that. And people that get on on uh, on Facebook, there's people that's got Facebook that are uh, they make videos and make money. Yep, because I have been Facebook has notified me 
about you know being able to um, make money if I you know produce enough videos on Facebook but I'm just not a much of a video producing on Facebook as I do YouTube I put more videos on YouTube well, Facebook is you know, it's just a different outlet to me it's I don't know something but uh, yeah and it's the internet people making money people can make money on just making videos you can take a video and put a gorgeous beautiful woman on the on the thumbnail this means the cover of that video and that woman not not even be in that video but you can make that that main photo your thumbnail with a beautiful woman on it and people I'm gonna tell you guys especially guys will be clicking on there to see because they want to look at looking for that woman but it won't be on there you know they won't be in the video it's it's called clickbait it's called clickbait and it just gives you credit for somebody clicking on your video but then again if they don't if they don't stay on that video over a certain amount of time you don't get the credit you don't get it you don't get that so and then it's not just guys that click on it. it you know it's got women whatever and women that are into women you know i think you call them lesbians or something like that or gay i don't know what they call it anyway um you just got to make a, a clickbait uh cover photo i guess um but it's kind of like trickery really because it's clickbait it's got nothing to do with the photo. And they have tricked me before, you know. If I see some weird looking thing or whatever, a photo, and I click on the video to see what it's what it all about, it might be some dude uh, videoing a, a turtle crawling across the yard or something. You know what I'm saying? It, it's totally different. But it's clickbait to get you to click on it, get views, whatever what it is. See? The YouTube goes by that, goes by views. Like my my channel, for instance, they're not gonna monetize my channel till I get at least over four thousand view time hours now hours view hours. Meaning everybody together that's watched my videos, it's got to accumulate up to a thousand hours of view time by everybody together. And. Uh, I was listening to something. So that, that's how that rolls. And you got to have over a thousand subscribers. Anyway. They want they want a big audience. If they're going to pay you to you know, advertise on it. They want a big, want you to be somebody that's got a big audience. People are interested. Anyway, moving on, moving on. Just talking about making money on the internet. That's all. Just talking about making money on the internet. I guess that should be the title of this video, but it's probably just going to be, you know, today's date on it. Um, not big on titles. It's just me. It's just me. The titles are good too because the title of your video is what, you know, the Google goes by too because if somebody types in they say they type in um traveling to work or uh, talk talking to you know, talk talk video or anything you know people google it it comes up you understand what i'm saying like if you put how to fix how to fix a pothole it goes in a category. Anybody that Googles anything about a pothole, this video, that video will pop up. It's just how it works. I know this video is probably boring to you. It ain't nothing exciting talking about. It's more exciting when I talk about relationships, I think. You know, it seems funny, you know, I'm not in a relationship, I guess. I'm just one of them people that. Hard to describe. Hard to describe. Anyway, I, I'm nobody to be giving advice, that's for sure. And I'm not giving advice, please. Anything I say on my YouTube channel is strictly my opinion. Don't take it as advice. Don't take it 
personal. Don't take it with, to, to heart. I'm not here to offend nobody. I'm not here to upset nobody. I am here just to talk to my camera and to each and every one of you that will watch this video. You are the people that mean the most to me on my YouTube channel. You are my supporters. You support me by watching my videos. You support me in the way that it supports me mentally because it gives me it gives me the uh, what is it? I'm trying to think of the word. It gives me gives me the motivation when you support me just by watching my videos or commenting on my especially comment comment on my videos that supports me by it when, when I mean support I mean it motivates me when you support me it motivates me and when especially when I see somebody comment on my videos that I care about oh my god it motivates me to make more videos you know, it just motivates me. Some people have that power. Some people have that power over other people to be able to motivate them. Um, it's a powerful thing. So, if you can motivate people, you motivate them. Just like, you know, when, if you're on social media and you comment on somebody's video, I mean, uh, well, I guess video. Yeah, if you go on Facebook and say you got friends or whatever and say you comment on their 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 their, their video, I mean, you comment on their post, like if you go on social media on your friends' pages and you comment on their uh their Facebook post. You're actually motivating them. It's a motivation thing. Because, you know, people need motivation. They need motivation. I need motivation. You know, I'm I'm out here all by myself. I make these videos all by myself. I don't have a best friend that hangs out with me or I don't have a best friend that I hang out with. I'm usually all by myself on the weekends. I tend to myself, I keep to myself. But when I put a video on YouTube, or if I put something on Facebook, and people click and comment on it, it motivates me. It motivates me in the way that, hey, somebody cares. Somebody thinks enough about me to make a comment. Somebody thinks enough about me to react to a, a, a post, a video, a YouTube, whatever it is. It's a motivational thing. So I appreciate each and every one of you. When you stop for a moment and you watch my videos and you, you watch them all the way to the end, it motivates me. It motivates me when you stop and you click the thumbs up. It motivates me. I don't hardly ever get thumbs up. I don't get click thumbs I can have somebody watch a, a live stream all day and not even give me a thumbs up. They don't really think about it, and I don't understand. I know I can understand that. Um, but it motivates me. I get a comment from somebody. It motivates me. If I get a comment from somebody that that, that, that really means a lot to me, it motivates me even more. Makes me feel good. Makes me feel, you know. Um, energized it makes me want to talk more makes me want to express myself more it just supports me and motivates me to do more because I got nobody folks I got nobody in my life except for y'all and every little bit of motivation that y'all give me just makes my day so much better makes my day so much better I'm a 58 year old pirate I don't know how many more years I got left on this world I have no idea 
You know, they say most people don't live past 75. My dad's in his uh, early 80s, mid 80s. I mean, and he's still around. But they say most average people don't live past 75. So that gives me what? 20 years? Less than 20? How am I going to spend these last years of my life? It would be nice, you know, to venture into certain things. Uh, but here I am making video because that's what I do for a living. I, I mean, not, not <laughs> because that's what I do for fun. It's a hobby of mine to make videos. So I like, I do it. Just something that gives, passes the time for me. Some people get online and sing all the time. That's their hobby. That's what they enjoy doing. That's what they do. Um, I'm not that great of a singer. So I don't really do a lot of singing. I mean, I've always been kind of quiet. and You know, I don't put myself out there. But, you know, shout out to a very special person that motivated me enough to put a song on YouTube. Yeah, me singing on YouTube. Imagine that. I mean, you know, that was that was a milestone right there for me to to do that. But I had the motivation of somebody that cared about me enough to to motivate me, to make me want to do that. Otherwise, I wouldn't have done that. I you, you haven't seen me do it since. That motivation left. I don't have that person motivating me to sing. You know, so I mean, anymore. I mean, I just, so I just make talk videos work videos boring videos that's all i do but that's what i'm doing you know that's cool um but i do get motivated when somebody starts commenting on my videos you know i died i like to do it a live stream but a lot of times signal's not good for me my phone just don't have a good signal or it might be the phone just cheap phone and it don't do good but it's just you know what can I say? What can I say? Anyway, folks, we rolling up here at the truck yard to get another wonderful day in. Lord have mercy. Got to get motivated. Got to get it up. Get it, get it going. Get it on. We got to shake and bake. We got to rock and roll. We got to uh, turn the wheel. We got to shake the trees and rake the leaves. We got to get it done, my friends. Because it's another day, another dollar. Time to make that KW holler. That Kenworth, that is. All right, folks. Here we are on the truck yard. Uh, time to get this, uh, get this thing started up. I got to get that truck checked out and all that kind of stuff. So... If y'all got to be out and about on the highways and byways of this big, beautiful planet we call Earth, by all means, do be safe, courteous, and nice. And do help somebody if you can. But above all, my friends, but above all, what I want y'all to do, but above all, what I want y'all to do, is I want y'all to be happy. I want y'all to smile. If you can't find a smile, you share a smile. That's the motivation I need. Share a smile. Brighten somebody's day up. It's gonna be a good day. Let's make it better. I appreciate each and every one of you. And like I said, if you gotta be out on the highways, the byways, do be safe and be courteous and be nice and do help somebody if you can. But above all, Stay positive, my friends. That's about the only thing that can get us through this crazy world. I love and appreciate each and every one of you. I really mean it. Thank you for watching. Until next time, I'm Mr. Jimmy. Peace out.